You know, it's amazing with Eddie. Uh, he's, you know, he was a groomsman at my wedding and I was, did part of his eulogy. We were really close friends, <laughs> but the, the legacy of Eddie, people remember Eddie like it was yesterday. And that shows you how great a person and, and a character he was, uh, how, how much people just loved Eddie Guerrero. And he was the right guy for me. <laughs> Without Eddie, JBL would have never happened. A funny story I've told a, a few times was when he and his brother Chavo came up with the heart attack angle for his mother, <laughs> then they were, we were backstage and they knew that JBL character wasn't getting over. We need something big to happen. And Chavo and Eddie pitched the idea to me. I thought it was magnificent. And then Chavo realizes Eddie's getting a little worked up. <laughs> so just like typical brothers, Chavo starts telling Eddie, he goes, how about then John hits mom with the clothesline? And Eddie looks at him, he goes, Chavo, mom's, I don't care what she was, 74 years old. He's not hitting her with a clothesline. And then, then Chavo's got to be goes, and then mom gets a little color. And Eddie now, it's, they're about to fight. He goes, okay, 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 okay. How about John just hits mom with a big boot? He wants me to big boot a 74-year-old lady. So, which Chavo's just ribbing Eddie. They literally stand up like they're going to fight. And I'm, I'm backstage with two brothers about to fight. I'm going, what do I do now? <laughs> you know, I just, and finally, uh, Eddie kind of backed off. Eddie knew Chavo was stirring him up. But Eddie still got mad at his own brother because only brothers can get brothers that mad.